Vaccination is an important practice that plays a prominent role in maintaining a good health status of uh, poultry birds. It is one of the most effective disease prevention measures practiced in poultry production. This is to provide adequate antibodies in the chickens uh, prior to the outbreak of uh, target disease at certain age. However, vaccine failure is real and does cause a detrimental effect on the chickens. Vaccine failure is simply the inability of the vaccine to stimulate the required antibody or immunity in the chickens to resist a targeted disease at a certain period. In today's video, I'm going to share with you eight causes of uh, vaccine failure. Number one, time of vaccination. Vaccines are best applied are in the cooler part of the day, either early in the morning or late in the evening. Vaccines are most effective during this part of the day because the birds are less prone to stress during this period of vaccination. If you administer uh, the vaccine during other parts of the day, most likely uh, the sunny part of the day, the birds themselves would have been stressed either as a result of feeding or flying around. The heat stress can also uh, stress the birds. There is a high percentage of vaccine failure and outbreak of the prevented disease early enough therefore vaccination during the early morning or late evening has a high success rate number two poor dosage of the vaccine vaccines come in dosage they have been uh, concentrated uh, to serve a particular number of chickens we have 1000 dose vaccine uh, for 1000 birds However, uh, from experience, it is best you double those your birds to eliminate uh, the doubt of failure. Number three, inadequate preparation of, for vaccination. Many poultry farmers do not know that they have uh, to prepare their chickens for vaccination. Preparation of chicken for vaccination starts about uh, two to three days before vaccination and uh, not the day of vaccination as most of the farmers do. Stop all forms of uh, medication at least three days uh, before vaccination. This eliminates the interference of the vaccine and uh, the medications to increase uh, the potency of the vaccine. Also, uh, serve your chickens multivitamins and anti-stress at about three days before vaccination and three days after vaccination. This helps uh, alleviate stress and gives chickens a uh, soccer against the range of vaccines faster. Since vaccines induce stress, uh, you need to build an ant stress within your birds for easy adaptability and resistance. Number four, wrong usage of vaccines it is not encouraging to know that some our farmers do not know the purpose of vaccination and uh, what vaccines are used for vaccination is only meant for healthy birds and not sick uh, or weak birds vaccines are not drugs they do not treat diseases but to prevent diseases do not waste your time, resources, and your birds by vaccinating them when they are unhealthy. It would fail. Treat them and ensure they are fine before our vaccination. Number five, a poor water quality. The water you are diluting the vaccines could be a potential inhibiting factor to the potency of vaccines. Water contains many impurities such as chlorine, heavy metals, acidity and alkalinity that can interfere uh, with the reaction of the vaccine negatively. Hence, 
it is best you check the quality of the water you are using before. Then number six, poor intake of vaccine solution. At times, the failure of the vaccination may be as a result of a poor intake of the vaccine solution by the birds. A vaccine is not a palatable and does not have a good taste. And in good condition, your birds would not want to take it. You need to find a way to stimulate the birds to drink uh, the vaccine if you do not want it to fail and waste. You need to stimulate thirst uh, by withdrawing water from the birds about one hour before vaccination. Uh, like for chicks in brooder, increase the brooder temperature. This makes uh, the birds thirsty and willing to drink any liquid that comes their way. Number seven, poor handling of the vaccine. The way you handle the vaccine uh, prior to administering could make it fail. Any activity uh, you want to do with the vaccines and the vaccination operation should not uh, be uh, more than one hour. Uh, 30 to 45 minutes is ideal. The longer the vaccination process, the higher the risk of its uh, failure. Be sure you dilute the vaccines in the water you know the birds would finish under 20 minutes. Discard any vaccine solution are uh, left over or excess after 30 minutes. Avoid direct exposure of vaccine uh, to sunlight and avoid freezing uh, vaccines. Do not uh, cut short or minimize the quantity of vaccine for any reason. A reduced uh, vaccine may fail to induce the required immune response uh, in your birds. Number eight, stress. Stress is one of the major causes that make vaccines fail after administration. Stress could be uh, in a form of maybe heat uh, majorly. It is highly recommended you serve a bird's anti-stress or multivitamins before and after vaccination. It makes your birds uh, recapitulate quickly and uh, aid the process of the vaccines. Lastly, adhere strictly to the manufacturer's instructions. Where chickens are vaccinated with uh, without strict adherence to the recommended rate in poor environmental condition, there is a high tendency of vaccine failure and outbreak of the prevented disease earlier than expected. Hope uh, you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like the video, share and consider subscribing to this channel. Hit that notification bell such that every time you upload a video, uh, you get to know. Bye-bye.